Hello, ladies and gentlemen. We are back in the overworld for episode two of our lovely survival series in 1.18, ladies and gentlemen. Anyway, we are getting into the bread and seeds of the episode. Let's get into it. Remember in the last episode, we found that lovely little uh, hideout. Well, I made it. I expanded so much on the base right now. I mean, not really expanded like too much. It's no, not as much as the other YouTubers do, you know, when they say they expanded something. But it's some decent additions. I have an actual freaking garden. Can I get left alone for five damn freaking seconds? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for perishing. We're actually stocking up on wood because we need a bunch of wood. And then we're going to go back down there. I got jumped by a bunch of zombies, so I, that's why I no longer have a freaking iron pickaxe. But it's fine. We'll just we'll just make more. <laughs> they were like, uh, and stole my shit. So <laughs> that's something. All right, I think I sell some iron over here. Hell yeah, brother. So we got our iron. We have uh, approximately five pieces. There's this uh, this world generation looks a lot different than it used to. I do say that. I mean, it may not a lot, like, majorly different, but it certainly is different than it used to be. So is the food system. <laughs> I feel like I'm constantly eating now. Ooh, I ate that something strange. I think this might have the extended version of the uh, bedrock. I mean, yes. The extended version of the uh, underground. It's basically... I just freaking ate! What the freak? I didn't even run around or do anything! God damn, my fucking character is a pig. Badass. I don't have the hunger effect. I don't know why I'm losing food so quickly. I'm literally just chopping down trees. Who knew chopping down trees would make you so hungry? Not this guy, I'll tell you that. We are simply walking right now. That's interesting. Snow out here. It's just like one singular patch of snow. This is one strip of snow. <laughs> That's weird. We've got a lot of flowers and stuff. Alright, we're getting our feel for where everything's at. So over here we have acacia trees. Over there we got some food. Hell yeah. I don't dare fall or that's like half my uh, <laughs> hunger bar right there. Get back here. Perish. Imagine if food could spoil in Minecraft. You know how horrible that would be? That means you could never stockpile. Unless you like canned it or whatever. I'm gonna shut up before the Minecraft devs are like, you know what? That's a great idea. Let's make Minecraft a little more difficult. Hmm. 
Hmm. Aidi. Why is there so many caverns everywhere? Help. Oh. <laughs> Look at the little guy. I need wool. Give me wool. Give me your wool. Ah, uh, and we're just gonna go ahead and toss down another crafting table. I probably have like sixteen crafting tables just somewhere in the world right now. Not yet, but we're getting there, guaranteed, 100%. I do really like them, like, the moss caves, that's what I'm gonna call it. <laughs> Fuck it, I'll leave that there. Perish. Look at all these little piggies. Ha! Smack! At least we're gonna have food now. I'm sorry, piggy. Smack. All right, we got enough food, I think. There's a lot of animals here. Dang it, it broke. So imagine what kind of furnishes it, furnishings we could do with all this. I never realized how quickly the sun goes into the sky in Minecraft. Alright, this is, uh... Damn. You know what? I wonder what would happen if you plant this outside. Anything? I like these bushes or whatever. Got that big drip leaf. That's weird. That could be like for a trap door or something. I wonder if you could, uh... Gosh, I wish I had sand right now. I would see if you could put sand on top of it. And if we'll... Mm. We're staying away from those. Mm -mm. It's a raiding party. Running down on the wire today, ladies and gentlemen. Get some sunflowers. I like sunflowers. They're cool. Apparently, they like the sun. They follow the sun. All right, we got some sand over here. We're going to experiment. Let's read this last piece of bread. That's it without the sand. Oh, that sucks. You gotta actually be physically standing on it. That's kind of disappointing. I, that would be a great trap, honestly. 
Just mind your own business. Boom. Yeah, let's get these sunflower boys. Some sort of helicopter flying over my house or something. Come on, let me get up there. I do like the blue flowers too. I like the light blue flowers better, but they're like really rare to get because they're only like swamp biomes. Or at least pretty rare. I don't know if they're like extremely rare. I think I just like flowers in general. Look at all these flowers. They look so nice. What am I, a botanist or something? Jesus. <laughs> We got a botanist on the chat, uh, in the on the channel, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, I remember this. This is the snowy fields of uh, the snowy fields. Yes, floating moss, peony. Let's throw down some moss here. I can't believe this is actually classified as a carpet. I don't know what these I don't know what these flowers are, but yes. <laughs> Lilacs. Lilacking way too much. Let's get some sweet rose bushes in here. We're just gonna hope none of these flowers I'm picking up are invasive species and we'll just take over the cave. <laughs> We're not even gonna dis we're not even gonna regard the uh, look at these poppies. Oh yep, that's that's good. I do like the flower fields of Minecraft. Ah oh, yes, we got some more saplings. Yes, that's good. That's good. a good part of Minecraft. It's so peaceful. I think it's actually called the flower meadows or whatever. These these look so sad. What are they what are they? Lily of the Valley. I wonder it looks so sad. <laughs> it's a sad flower. There's our uh this looks like a big giant like egg or something. Legends say there was a dragon that lived here 3,000 years ago. As big as, it, and it was as big as them. I was as big as New York is. I don't know if that's actually, it would be that big. I mean, if you consider a, hmm. That's something to think about. Alright. Now the fun part. Getting back into the cave. I think our health's good now, just you wait. This is the same way I came up. Ooh. Whew, that's kind of hair raising, not even gonna lie. We got a little secret back door here. It's not really a secret, but brings us right into our base. Ah, it's beautiful. I do plan on decorating the outside of it with like flowers and stuff. Once we get more like dirt and stuff. Now first, 
We're grabbing some food. Also smelting down our iron again. Puny. I wonder if you could plant this on... Uh, You can. Nice. That's all I needed to... Ooh. Come on, come and get some, funny man. <laughs> Do I have any moss blocks in here? I'm going to go ahead and just seal this up. Okay, we're actually making this, we're actually going to start camouflaging it. Those bats are making me kind of paranoid right now. Of course, if I make it paranoid, ah, uh, yes. If I make it paranoid, yes. If I make it camouflage, it's going to be kind of hard to see. I guess that's the whole idea of camouflage, in a sense. So if we like make it like this, it's kind of like round out the edges. Just like add definition on the side or something. We're gonna put some glow berries. Oh, I don't have any glow berries, but we're gonna we will uh, once we get some. We're gonna hang them on the side and hopefully she starts glowing. I don't know if you could actually like like put fertilizer on them. We'll find out, huh? Oh, it's already working, because I already forgot to where I was going. Let it grow big and strong. Look at that. Ha, yes. That's actually a great natural light, light source. Why did they go low, though? Why, yeah, like, why do they glow? Hmm. Anyway, we got that. Although we could put a flowering, uh, whatchamacallit here. Azula. Oh. I'll put this here. It'll still like slightly glow, which is good. I'm just casually getting rid of most of our like evidence of man made structures being in here. He said most, not all. She, uh, nope, that ain't gonna work like that. Oh, shoot. I have just flooded out half my crops. It's gonna be a good time for us. Okay, there we go. I think that looks camouflaged enough. It certainly doesn't stick out like a sore thumb. Which is honestly pretty good. 
We have our secret entries now. Hopefully nothing else figures out how to get in here. I think we're good. I don't even know how to get in here sometimes. Ooh. Well, he looks a lot different than I remember. Okay, so we got that. Dang it. I still forgot to get one of those. I could have put one of those in here as well. Right. Ooh, yeah. Look at all these Wheatleys. <laughs> oh, we should AFK for like a little bit and then see like how it is afterwards. At least we got a lot of wood and stuff. I'm really glad that we have like a lot of resources. Yeah, and I have an extra bed too. <laughs> now, with our next episode, we're actually going to go what? look for this buried treasure. So, yeah. Alright, well, I think we're actually going to end this episode here because uh, there really isn't too much more to work on right now. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe if you guys haven't already, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.